Filipino Bank, our government hopes to be even more responsive to the banking and remittance needs of overseas Filipinos, migrant workers, and immigrants alike. So again, thank you for making the DFA and myself part of this. Uh, our prayers and tell us, do not ask us uh, what you need. Tell us what you need and it's our obligation to provide it. God bless po. Thank you. Pakiramdam nyo na bukod sa idol, meron pa kayong OF Bank o Overseas Filipino Bank. Malaking tulong po kasi hindi na po kami may hihirapan. May sarili na po kami bangko na makakatulong sa amin. Saka mas useful po para sa amin, lalo na pagka pagaya namin, kailangan namin mag-loan, kailangan namin mag-invest. Meron na po kami matatakbuhan over Filipino. Thank you po kay President Duterte. Eh, eh, maganda po kasi at least meron kami mapagdadala ng savings namin na alam namin secure. Uh, maganda kasi makakatulong, siguro mabilis na makapag-loan, mabilis na mag-save, tsaka yung bago ngayon pwede nang mag-invest. Mas maganda. Mas makakatulong sa mga OFW na katulad namin. Lahat kami workers, no? that's how I like to remind everybody, we are all workers of government and we serve the people. We at the Overseas Filipino Bank draw inspiration from the leadership of our President, Rodrigo Roa Duterte, which puts utmost importance on the welfare of our overseas Filipinos. Establishing the OFB fulfills the President, President Duterte's campaign promise to Filipinos working abroad in order to support their dependents at home. Isang malaking karangalan na ipakilala ko sa inyo ang Pangulo ng Republika ng Pilipinas, si Mayor Rodrigo Roa Duterte. Hindi, balikan ko, hindi ako na mamulitika. It was the man on the street nagpanalo sa amin. Today, we make history, and we dedicate this chapter in grateful recognition of the immeasurable sacrifices and immense contribution of our overseas Filipinos to what our nation is now. Pangulong Rodi, itong Overseas Filipino Bank ay katuparan po ng inyong pangako sa mga overseas Filipino workers. Uh, nangako po ako ng eleksyon na tatayo ako ng isang bangko para sa inyo para lesser expense, lesser charges kasi gobyerno. Pati ang gusto ko na eventually uh, ma ang OFW will own the uh, bank of China. Uh, total, uh, magkaisa naman kayo and you have the money you eventually become the owner. Ito tinayo na ito na para, para sa inyo. Complied na ako sa promise. Take care of the ordinary human being. Kasi ako, Presidente, halos masabi ko, para lang ako sa mga kababayan ko, ordinary. Hindi man mahirap, ordinary yung Pilipino.